What, what are you doing, microphone? I can't believe he's fueled by balls. It's actually crazy. Dude, honestly, I, I'm so happy we got sponsored Wait, by balls. Wait, is anyone? Huh? Alright, I'll move my table, my chair up. Oh, Alright. Byleth is wolf. Oh, he's bringing out the Byleth. Interesting, interesting. He doesn't usually play Byleth that much, he usually plays uh, Pithra. But it's gonna be an interesting pick. Alright. Pithra, I don't think, has the best matchup against Wolf. That's true, that's true. It's a bit of a, it's a bit difficult, because it's harder to win neutral. Oh! And getting him with the uppie. Alright, trying to get the ledge trap. Violet may be a better matchup than Aegis, but it's definitely not easy. That's true, that's true. Wolf can kind of just dominate neutral. And plus, Violet has such good edge guarding against Wolf. Well, I guess not everyone does, but... <laughs> still a pretty good but Wolf, Wolf has a really good recovery. What? Deceptively good recovery. True. I, it's not that bad, but the thing is that Violet can cover it easier. Yeah. Ooh, he stretched out a shield. Well, it's just the fact that it stalls. I haven't either. But All right, apparently he does. Atharva says I've never seen him play Pithra. He played Pithra a lot during uh, Holodeck. Yeah, I think he almost got to like... Yeah, he went 3-2 and he was playing... I'm pretty sure that Violet is his main. Violet and Snake. He plays a lot of characters. Oh! And Violet, Snake, PT. I think it was main three. Oh, boy. Ooh, almost gets to the down smash. It's a very back and forth game right now. Yeah, just keeping his advantage. Yeah, he's trying to push his advantage as hard as possible. Starting trying to go for that hard read. Oh. I'm trying to connect with that back air. Oh, trying to get the grab. Trying to go for ledge pressure. Yeah, As he's, he's got to respect that. As As, that was, was very good ledge trapping. Francis was not at all letting him get that advantage. It's crazy. All right, got him off stage. Ooh, almost getting him with that F smash. That definitely would have killed. Wolf is surprising the light. Yeah. Okay. Right. also just really strong. Yeah. Absolutely. He's basically just better Ganondorf. Yeah. Oh. What? Ah. Uh, ooh, ooh, nice. Really? Paper back air. That's nice. That's nice. Oh, up B. Ah, almost connecting with that down air. good DI. Yeah, he got good DI. And he got the air dodge, too. Oh. Ooh, good Ooh, oh, oh, up throw, up B. Ooh. Ah, didn't connect with the sweet spot. That would have done way more damage. But still pretty good. Still pretty good. Just barely whiffing that timer. All right, dash attack. He's got him off stage. Ah. Whiffing the side B. Oh, I'm surprised he went for grab there. Same, yeah. It's pretty interesting neutral they're playing right now. Oh, got Ooh. the grab him. He never really goes for combos, I think I noticed with Sonny. He only well, he's going for, like, he's getting a lot of damage off of this, but I feel like if you, uh, like, if you're down a full stop, you kind of need to throw out a bigger attack sometimes. Yeah, absolutely. He's like, I, I would have liked to see, instead of, like, one of those grabs, uh, run up down smash, because that still would have caught the roll. Yeah. He's going for a lot of, um... Like, he has gotten, like, 60% out of this advantage state, but it doesn't really amount to anything if if you lose the stock first. Yeah, absolutely. He's trying to get for better positioning than... Oh! Which Espanjum just got. There we go. Spike. Game one goes to Espanjum. That was a great game. That was a great game. Yeah. Really solid advantage state and just neutral recovery from Sunny. But Espanjum just taking the stock at the end. All right, what stage are you going to go to? Honestly, what stage would you pick against uh, Byleth? I don't really know. I think that Byleth doesn't really have a lot of weaknesses stage-wise. Yeah. Small up, yeah. Small, that makes okay. sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, it's a very neutral stage for a lot of characters. Yeah. Like, no character really has, Same like... Matchup, yep. Yeah. Right. No character really has, like, a sort of advantage on PS2. So it's a good pick. It's a good pick. Yeah, I think that Wolf likes this stage a bit more just because he can, he can play a little bit more aggressive. Yeah. And the platform heights are good for extensions. Oh, <laughs> the Tekra. Alright, you got the advantage. Yeah, Ooh. it's gonna be those. Ooh! Ah! Oh, that would have been so clean. See, that, that, that scenario, I would have liked him to be a little bit more conservative. Absolutely. Just go for another up air, something else. So the thing is, Sonny goes for a lot of S smashes in neutral, like trying to go for hard reads. Well, not necessarily. That's kind of what I was talking about last game, that he was very conservative with how he was approaching his virtual game. In this one, I think he realized that he needs to be a bit more out there. Yeah, yeah, so he, sure. he is throwing out these strong attacks, and he's taking an early lead because of it. In that scenario, I think... I don't know if he was spaced correctly. What was it? Oh, it's my bad, my bad. 
Yeah, and now S Phantom with a sizable deficit. Yeah, once. Oh! Ooh, that was a really good reflector. Oh, yeah, that was an absolute. He hadn't used that one yet, but S Phantom wasn't expecting it. <laughs> he hasn't been using it at all for edge guarding, so it's great that he used it now. Yeah. Especially to almost get that stock. Ah, whiffing the pivot grab. At this point, um, Wolf just. He really can just play it slow. Like, if he gets a bit of space, he should just be starting to yeah, zone he, out with laser. Yeah, he, he can force uh, S Phantom to take approaches, which isn't really Violet's strong suit, so it, it's a good option. It's a good option. Yeah, Violet is much better when the opponent uh, approaches her or him. Ooh. But he hasn't really used laser at all. Yeah, he hasn't. He hasn't. Which is kind of surprising because it's a really solid tool for Wolf. He's been playing. Like after that F throw, you just throw out a laser because there's no commitment. Yeah. Laser. Ooh. That was a good read. That was good. That was good. Up till it's a, that. Uh, really wolf. big hitbox. Exactly. It's almost like a. <laughs> it's really strong. Mini Wolf. <laughs> yeah. It's, or Mini Snake. Yeah, Mini Snake. Yeah. I, I've always said that. <laughs> yep. Ooh, down throw dash to. Ah, oh, whipping the touch chase. Ooh, it's a good up smash. That's a really good up smash, yeah. Really back and forth neutral right now. Almost breaking a shield there with a the down air. Ah, oh, missing the love trap with the F smash. Yeah, he hasn't really gotten any of those nair dash attacks. It's kind of a staple for Violet. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, that The fits. MK layup. <laughs> Alright, looks pretty even right now. Or, <laughs> never mind. Yeah, <laughs> the first time he went for blaster neutral, it, <laughs> it didn't go in his favor, so. Probably not going to be using yeah. it that much. I think it's Sunny. If Sunny is playing this, like, this game really well, and right now, like, that was great, just playing it safe, because eventually, even if you get that percent, something will kill. Ooh! Maybe look, the other way, though. This is looking really good for S Phantom right now. Yeah, but... Ooh! Uh, yeah. If nice! He, S Phantom takes a stock. If he plays that too conservatively. And that's the step for Threw out a risky option. And it worked.